not planning to go anywhere. Uh, and I, if I have to stay here forever, I will. We don't need to wait for more people losing their kids. So we have more people fighting for this. Since I lost Joaquin, more than 150,000 people have lost their lives because of gun violence. Not one more. Not one more. Woo! Not one more. Not one more. We met Joe and we started talking and he told us to find purpose in life and that was probably the best advice that I could get from a leader. Find a reason to get up every morning and do something to prevent this from happening again. Manny and Patricia, I want to thank you so much for being here today, for sharing uh, your memory of Joaquin. We exchanged ideas. He promised me that he will know how to put an end on gun violence, that he did it before. So he knew exactly how to do this, how to make it happen. I trusted him and I voted for him. As a result, now I have him as a president. Now I'm here holding him accountable because all those promises, in some way, haven't turned into reality. I want to meet President Biden so he can make a commitment around gun safety. I also want him to address his commitment, the urgency to fight gun violence during the State of the Union, because that will send a strong message to the whole society and believe that we can have other options and finally put an end on this.